Marcia, what was for you the biggest issue with this proposal? Well, I mean, every part of it, I'm afraid. It was almost designed, to, I mean, it looks like it was designed to be a deliberate insult to the president. For instance, it, doesn't, it did not just amnesty the people with the DACA work permits, who are the subject of what we're talking about here. It gave amnesty, a whole new, brand new, from scratch amnesty to all the so-called dreamers. So that's probably three million people rather than just 700,000 DACAs. It also, and this maybe is the part that really got my goat, it gave work permits to the parents of all of those so-called dreamers. But the whole point of the DREAM Act and of all of this push for DACA is that these people are, came as children, uh, came before they turned 16 years old. It's not there, they didn't break the law knowingly and so they shouldn't be punished and there's something to that argument but their parents obviously knew what they were doing they were adults and yet this proposal would have amnestied all of them permanently given them indefinitely renewable work permits uh, like I said it was it seems to me to have been a deliberately crafted insult to the president however we got here mark what is there that you could agree to from what you just said it sounds like you could agree to something that allowed people who were brought here as minorities when they were young children and who now have work permits would you agree to let those people in give them green cards a path towards citizenship absolutely under certain circumstances because that would be an amnesty i mean i'm for it but let's be honest about what it is but every amnesty has consequences one is it attracts new illegal immigration and two, it creates downstream more chain migration as those people sponsor their relatives a few years down the road. So you have to deal with those two consequences. If you did, if you got rid of chain migration and had real enforcement measures, I would be happy to have a package like that that gave the DACA's work, um, you know, not work permits, but green cards permanently. The problem is, the Democrats seem to be willing to throw the DACA people under the bus in order to preserve chain migration and keep it going.